Did y'all see those, uh, the doors of the church open when y'all came in? Did you see the heat blowing in? Those were diesel heaters blowing in because we didn't want you to be cold this morning. We spent, had spent $3,000 to make sure that you guys were warm this morning because watch this, MLG and W accidentally cut our gas line during construction. And we don't have heat in, in the building because, because the lines that connected the power source that create a flame in order for us to keep the heat in the house was severed. Uh, and, and some of y'all uh, don't have any power in your life, uh, any fire in your faith, because somebody has severed the connection between you and God. Some, some of y'all, some of y'all, some of y'all in here today, uh, uh, it's not because, it's not because, uh, because you've been evil, it's because something outside yourself has severed the connection. And God is saying, I'm trying to get power back in your house, but can you press through what it is that you're going through and show up anyway in spite of what's been severed? Watch this. Once we discovered that we had been cut off on the outside, it required us to do some work on the inside. So Pastor Michael Douglas and Pastor Dana told me, Pastor, we had to get some contractors to come in and fix some leaks. We discovered that after the, the, the lines were cut outside, it made us do introspection on the inside and discover that we got leaks on the inside as well as what they had done on the outside. Watch this. Some of the stuff that has been cut out on the outside has made you now look on the inside. Some of y'all are wondering why you've lost certain relationships, why you've lost certain jobs, why you've lost certain connections. God says, because I had to do something to make you look inside yourself. Because many of y'all have been too focused on what people are doing on the outside that you have failed to realize that I got an oil leak on the inside. Am I preaching right now? How many of y'all can tell the truth that at some point in your life there's been a leak in this old building and your soul and y'all ain't going to talk to me in here. Look at your neighbor and say, check your leaks. Why am I cussing so much lately? Check your leaks. Why do I feel like hitting somebody check your leaks why do i feel so depressed check your leaks something's not right because your connection was severed and you didn't even know it